Assalamualaikum, hey everybody, it's Nalibi and I'm going to be doing my June favourites, which is quite exciting because um, I've got so much stuff to show you guys that I've been loving. Um, the first thing, oops, sorry, first thing I'm going to show you is what I'm wearing on my lips now. And I've only had it for a while, but I thought I might as well add it in because I won't be doing July or August favourites because I won't be in the country, so... Um, actually I might do it July, not sure. But it's um a lipstick by Accessorize like this and it's called Passiona in shade six. And these were half price down from four something to two twenty five, something like that. And I what it is, um I, I like the consistency, I really do, and I really love the colour. However, when you do apply it, like it it's really weird because like it does stay on for a while and it's really nice and moisturizing but when you're putting it on like you ha i had to put it on for quite a while if you get what i mean because it kept being really sheer and stuff and i can't stand the packaging it's actually cardboard why would you make cardboard lipsticks like seriously they're gonna get wet anything could happen and like as you can see i'm kind of struggling with closing it yeah, the packaging is terrible. They've got to fix up. However, I do love the colour, the shade. It's really nice. And for two, for two pounds something, this is amazing. I love the shade, and I really like the way it is on my lips. It's really moisturising. Doesn't dry me out, and I don't get the the white line that a lot of lipsticks do. So like this. Then the next two stuff um is my mum bought back for me from Russia, and it's um the Russian traditional scarves. So I got a red one look how beautiful they are so beautiful and this one they're quite small this one's huge I haven't seen this big one before and it's shocking pink it's so bright my camera cannot handle this I love it um next thing is I am a lover of tea not even a lover that's not even I'm obsessed with tea like you know how people are with coffee and my that with tea my day is incomplete without tea um I've, i tried this puka love one out just like this and i really like it and the taste like it's really addictive as well the taste like you drink it and you're like mm, it's okay and then you get the aftertaste and it's like mm, i want some more it's so weird it says organic rose chamomile and lavender flower tea to warm your heart and I got this from Holland and Barrett's. I think, if I'm correct, the big Tesco's do this. Or m I don't know, I'm not sure. But um, I really like it. And it says organic. And apparently it's like really healthy and really good for you. I love this. Next thing is mascara. These two are so amazing. They're my favourite mascaras. It's the L'Oreal Flutter. Sorry, the L'Oreal Full Slash Flutter and the L'Oreal Telescopic, both in black. Like that, and they're normal, just standard ones, they're not waterproof ones. I got a waterproof one, but I have yet to try it, to try it out, and I love them, they're amazing. That's all I'm saying, amazing. Next is, um, is the Too True Effortless Waterproof Eyeliner. I used to use this back in school, well, I started, like, using it in year 11 and stuff, I never really used to wear makeup, but this was for like non uniform day Eid and stuff and then I used it in college throughout like the whole college I love it and I've gone back to it and I thought I'll just let you know this is my favourite um eyeliner and I think it's like it's either a pound or two no more than that it's really affordable and it's great and this is the waterproof one I really like the waterproof one um I also love the brush um don't like the normal one then um this thing i have to hype about this thing seriously this um actually somebody told me to talk about makeup worth the hype i think i'm gonna do products worth the hype rather than makeup because there's amazing things out there that aren't be like a lot of them products aren't hyped up and i feel like they should because they're amazing and maybe they're not amazing for other people but for dry skin people it's amazing and i know a lot of my viewers i do have dry skin because all of you guys email me and message me all the time asking about things so i do base most of my beauty videos on dry skin 
not most of them, all of them, sorry, because obviously I have dry skin, so I can only relate to dry skin people. Anyway, this is the Nina Ricci Mattifying Teaser, sorry, yeah, Mattifying. It doesn't say it on this, it says in the box, sorry. Um, This is the Teaser on Fresh Finish Mattifier. Mattifiers normalizes, refreshes. Looks like this. And this is from TK Maxx, and it was like £10, went down to £3.99. I know I say I have dry skin, however, as you can see now, you can't really see it right now because I only applied my foundation not long ago, but my T-zone gets really oily, and it's really weird because the oil that comes out, it doesn't moisturise my face, it just sits there. And it's so annoying, this really does the trick. Literally, as I, I put it on, like, I dot it here, 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 here and then on my forehead as I'm putting it on <clears throat> my voice is going as I'm putting it on I can feel not feel sorry I can see this working like literally I put it on and the shine is gone no joke it lasts really long like I think the most I've worn this was like five or six hours and I was fine I did not even need to powder my face and I don't usually put only part of my face when it gets oily so halfway through the day this thing is amazing and it says apply after daily skincare to the t-zone and or over makeup to freshen up oh you can put it over makeup that's really good okay next thing is um gosh primer i love it it works really well with my next favorite which is the illamasqua skin base foundation these two together are so 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 good um yeah i love the primer this foundation if you have dry skin this is possibly the best foundation ever like i've tried a lot of foundations amazing this is better than my dual one by the way and i got it in shade 06 that sounds quite dark um but yeah 06 and it's a yellow based so it looks like this and amazing that's what I'm saying, amazing. And you know when I say something's amazing, there's nothing else to say because that's how good it is. It's amazing. Like, it's really good. It's Everybody keeps asking, your face looks flawless, blah, blah, blah. What do you do? I do that. And also, what you need to do afterwards is get a beauty blender. I just purchased this because my other one was from H&M. And um, it, it looks disgusting, so I didn't want to show you. But I wanted to show you this one. It's a beauty blender and it's like 3 99 Two ninety nine, something like that, from Super Drug, and this thing is amazing. Well, I haven't tried this one, but the one I used, you wet it a bit and you go over it. Even if you have dry skin, honestly, your makeup looks flawless. I like you guys. Have, if you don't do this, what is wrong with you? Like when I tried it, I was like, why didn't I do this a long time ago? Why? I knew about it. Why didn't I do it? I was really scared because the whole concept of putting. A watered sponge on my face and I have dry skin but no it's totally fine like it's amazing next thing is I've been loving is um this is so bad this is really really bad and naughty of me unbelievable can't believe I'm doing this um I bought this is my mom's is this her birthday present or is this mother's day I can't remember so bad that's terrible. I can't remember that it was her mother. Was it Mother's Day present? Or was it her birthday? It was Mother's Day. This was my mum's Mother's Day present. And she doesn't really use makeup. And she's not really like a brand person. Like she doesn't use any big brands or anything. She doesn't really use much. Um, but I thought I'd get her one because she really likes brown pencils. And she hasn't found the perfect one. So I thought let's get her this. This was like £21 or something crap like that but um it just looks like this and it comes with a sharpener and it says wire cell on it so you know and anyway it's waterproof and it's amazing i'm babbling so much today but yeah um i really like the way this comes on i i didn't really buy it because it was waterproof i just bought it because um i really wanted to try it out and well really wanted to give it to my mom so she can try it out and tell me but then i ended up using it so yeah but she doesn't mind she's like it's okay you can use it too anyway next thing is um you people that don't know me probably be quite surprised um i'm putting this in my favorites because i dye my hair crazy colors 
all the time. It's, yeah, anyway, I use the this brand all the time. The I'm, I can say it in my head, but I can't say it out loud. But it's that brand. And the Live Color XXL. And I used, like, I think I've used every single, um, like, you, you know how they have different stuff in in the brand i've used all of them and i love this and this is i got this one um i haven't used this one yet but i used the other blonde one before a few times and this is 008 abs absolute platinum so um i really if you guys want to dye your hair this is permanent by the way i hate selling permanent stuff but um if you guys like dying hair or you want to try i would say this is the best brand to go for if you want to dye your hair this is possibly the best thing ever i've used a lot of other brands but um i always come back to this one so it's my favorite next thing is um something I actually got sent but um i had to include this because i've been using this a lot and a lot of people keep asking me what i use on my face so i thought i might as well just add it since i'm not really a makeup um i would love to film makeup videos for you guys but every time i do they fail they absolutely fail and like my i don't know what goes happens but um basically and i leave um the link to where i got this from like it's basically like that a lot of makeup artists have the same palette and a lot of normal people have the same palette it looks like this and it's amazing and what i do um the colors are really really pigmented let me just show you that's okay you can't really i can't my camera doesn't do it justice like honestly it's so good and what i use i've used the black one as eyeliner a few times it's good um it is really good i use the white one to do my to highlight my brows i haven't got it on today but that's what i usually use it's really really good um i've done like i've done a pink and green emerald green look before and i've done quite a few stuff and i absolutely love them and they're metal i'm not really into metallics but honestly i love their um shimmery and metallic ones as well they're so good it's sedona lace but um this palette is really good i totally totally love it and that's the end of my um favorites i had a lot of stuff and i had to talk a lot this video is probably the longest video i've done in so so long do you like my scarf it's from hijabi barbie and i'll link in the description box below i love it love it so much i love mint and it's such a such a um spring summer look as well but yeah i'll see you in my next video bye